So uh, before I have a question about Mickey Calloway and Aaron Boone. But before that, my dad and I were were arguing the other day. Right. He says that Mantle's the greatest. I think he's overrated. Yeah. Mate, you know what? Listen to your father more. Really, yeah. Mike? Really, you don't know. I hate to tell you, you don't have a clue what you're talking about. But that's okay. Mike, Listen, he, that's okay. Now explain to Mike, me. Wait, 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 pull up his stats. Wait, 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 Let's talk about the fact that he's not that big of a power hitter and that he never he, stole that many bases. He's not that big of a power hitter. He's, he's not. not. If he, 536 homers weren't enough? There's not as much as people would want to think. Oh, really? And why would stolen bases be important? What, what, what exactly like, is the importance? There's a false quote attributed listen, to him that he said listen, that it Listen, means- listen, Drew, Drew, I'm not going to sit here because you get dumb about a minute. I mean, it's not even worth my breath to get into that, okay? Just go look. And from 51 to 62, his numbers rank with anybody's of all time in terms of producing runs, which is what the game is about. The idea is to produce runs. The idea is to get home. That's the whole idea of the game. Check it out. 51 to 62 ranks with anybody ever. Now, from 62 on, the numbers fall apart. You know, he got old. He didn't take care of himself. We all know the whole problems. He drank too much. All the different things. But 51 to 62, despite all the injuries, despite the osteomyelitis, despite all the injuries, he was one of the most proficient offensive players of all time. When we come back.